<laughs> Hello everyone, it's Alex and welcome back to my reaction channel. Today we're reacting to Demon Slayer episode 6. So, in the previous episode we had Tanjiro being trained by the Loth, Serpent and Wind Hashira and three of those Hashiras appeared in one episode, episode 5, which was super exciting because it was really good to see them. There were some scary things happening by the end, but now Tanjiro is moving on to the stone Hashira with Zenitsu, which I think is going to be super hilarious knowing Zenitsu's character. And we'll see just what kind of training they'll be going through and whether they'll be able to actually complete it. I'll be holding my fingers crossed for Tanjiro as he's my favorite, favorite, favorite character. And hopefully in the next episode, we will see Nezuko as well, which is my second favorite character. I'm kind of a little bit sad that we didn't see much of Mitsuri. I feel like her character is more for a giggle, more for a laugh because she's the love Hashira, she's funny, sweet, kind, um, a little bit goofy and no one really takes her too seriously. I think she's really badass when she wants to be. Uh, she provides a bit of a fun service with her costume, no doubt. But I know a lot of people likes it. I personally probably wouldn't cosplay her because I don't think my chest is, is, is of enough of a big size to do a proper cosplay of Mitsuri. All of them, it's maybe something that I could fix with wearing a, a rubber breast, just like my favorite YouTuber Vlad does. But yeah, maybe not, maybe not, maybe not this time. I've, I've enjoyed cosplaying as Nezuko. I think the next character I'd like to cosplay as would be one of the upper ones. But okay, you guys, without further ado, let's jump into episode 6 of Demon Slayer. If you enjoy watching my channel, click on the like button to help my channel grow. And if you're curious about my future reactions, subscribe. Thanks! I don't think I could do it, could you? Zanitsu's face literally tells you everything. Simple. Zanitsu <laughs> The strongest of the Demon Slayer corpse. So that's the stone Hashira, right? <laughs> oh. I shouldn't laugh. I think it's, if I was in his case, I'd be... <laughs> I'd be really cold. <laughs> Oh! <gasps> Whoa! I don't think Zenitsu realizes how much power he has. Look how he just literally almost teleported with his speed. But yeah. But Tanjiro is going for it. He can never hear his name right. Oh, bless. Everyone chanting different things. <laughs> oh, Tanjiro. I genuinely feel so bad for him. He goes for so much harsh training. 
I stood under one of those fountains once at the swimming pool and that is a really heavy waterfall. This one, I think it would break me on half. Somebody's got an appetite. <laughs> Rattling beads. Who's cooked those fish? They must be really tasty. It's even his. I've mentioned that. あの、さんはきっと自分もあんないわ。一丁も動かせねえよ。<笑><笑> He must be like listening from behind or watching them up close. Because the timing was just perfect for uh, Stone Hashi removing that stone. <laughs> so needs to always take it out and poor Tanjiro. <laughs> Tanjiro just lets him. <laughs> well, he's done really well, isn't it? So he got so far. He's strong himself. Oh my god! <laughs> oh, he's still chanting. <laughs> that crap is just so funny. <laughs> I really like crowds in this anime, they really add a lot into uh, into the comedy. Nice. Now the hardest part, I suppose. She's spying on all of the members of the Demon Corps. She knows whereabouts of 60% of Demon Slayers. <sighs> I am feeling chills. I can't help but laugh the way he sings Subarashi. <laughs> Like, I know he's a buddy, but he's so bad as... <laughs> Interesting skill. Ugh, the sound those eyes make when they move. <laughs> Don't like it. Bad news, bad news. I don't think you will find Boyashiki because he never leaves the mansion. He can't. He's going to destroy his feet. It's not the great, it's not the best footwear on this occasion, I think. I mean, they understand the limits, right? Can't blame them. I'm sure each one of them has done their best, and Tanjiro is always the best motivation. He has so much respect for these guys as well. It is, honestly, admirable. Oh. 
And he's he's doing a really great motivational speech. I don't think he's realizing how good he is. I really like that about him. Oh. <laughs> He's like a... What's the word for a husband? A, not a housewife. A house husband? あの、柱たちがほとんど継ぐ子いない理由。何ですか?遠慮すぎてみんな逃げちゃうんだろう。ああ、それとかあの金髪みたいにさ、柱との違いにうちの。先に継ぐ。俺たりさ。こういうのを
いつでも一瞬で集中を極限まで高められる俺の反復動作はまず大切な人の顔を思い浮かべることあそれから煉獄さんの言葉を思い出すことここで思い出すわあ No, that's something. He's doing it. Yeah, I got a cook with a joke. 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 I got a cook. それを何度も何度も何度も繰り返しているうち体が覚え始める、wow. Memories of the family he cherished People who wants to protect Amazing Mr. Rengoku who Inspired many many people You know what? I'm glad he doesn't know how Oboyashiki looks like because the master is in a really weak state now. He literally cannot move. As we saw, he barely speaks. It must be an excruciating pain. I really don't know what happened to him and why he's suffering so much. But once Muzan finds out about the condition of Oboyashiki, the whole demon slayer corpse will be in danger. After all, demon slayers, they do need their leader. And if the leader passes away in the wrong time, it won't be just bad for the morale. Do you know what? I've heard that the next episode is going to be about 40 minutes long and the next one will be even longer, which is very interesting because we are only getting eight episodes instead of the usual 10, 12. And then there has been a leak from someone who is a very trustworthy source on the Twitter X. And apparently the next season, the Infinity Arc will consist of four movies. I guess so they can more, make more money by releasing them in cinemas. Interesting, right? Just imagine how long that arc will be and just how many things will happen there. I don't think there is anything after the Infinity Arc. Is there? Can someone let me know down in the comments? I'm really curious. But yeah, it looks like next episode will be about the past and story of uh, the Stone Hashira. So I'm looking forward to it and definitely looking forward to the longer episode. I'll see you there then. A massive thank you to anyone supporting my channel, particularly my Patreons and Isaac. For those of you who don't know, I do have a Patreon where you can find uncut, full length and 100% opacity videos, early release. On top of that, I react to Patreon exclusive anime titles. And as my Daimyo Patreon, you can even get a shout out in the video. Alternatively, you can join this channel as my YouTube channel member, gain access to other exclusive perks, and all of this you can find in links below. Your support means the world to me, and all of the donations go towards the equipment subscription and building my YouTube studio, which is something I'm planning for the future. It's been a joy to watch this anime with you, so I do hope to see you in the next episode. Bye!